Kearney got underneath that. Coyle carries again, and it's there! And Felix Healy has got the breakthrough. And Cork, who were put under terrible pressure again in the air, found no answer to Felix Healy coming from the deep. I think most people in that division expect Limerick to win it, given the budget that they have, the players that they have, they've got mega bucks, they're even paying guys more money than, than what's available in the Premier Division and uh, everybody assumes that it's going to be, they're going to walk away with it and then it's a question of how everybody else does. It'll be tight, it's a very tough league, a lot of very big sides, not a lot of football played. Um, but if we can get we can get a decent enough start and get a bit of confidence, a wee bit of momentum, I think we'll do okay. Well, I think we we've tried to bring in athletes, uh, good athletes as well as good footballers. Uh, we've tried to change the dressing room from last year as well. Uh, I think too many people took defeat too easily, uh, and we've uh, we want a wee bit more character. So that the players that, that we've brought in, yeah, they're they're all. They're all decent athletes and they all have a bit of bite about them as well. And a wee bit about them in terms of they care a wee bit more maybe uh, than one or two in the past. But uh, but uh, in football you never know. It's uh, I think it's important that we, we, we start particularly in the first three or four games. And if, as I say it's all down, I mean confidence is massive and, and momentum is, you know, that's at times, that's a massive difference in football. Uh, so it's important that we start well. Well in terms of, of promotion, uh, whether it's out of the question or not, are, are, is, is the club ready for it? It's more the question, are we ready to, 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 to make that step and go up into the Premiership? Um, I'm not sure. Uh, I suppose that you know at this minute in time it's it's two teams going up, but there are rumours flying around as well that four teams could go up and there only is a Premier Division, and if that was the case then it'd be vital that we were in it. Um, but I've never really been one for for setting goals. You know it's important next game. Are you pleased with the way the squad's coming along before the start of the season? Yeah, it's taken along nicely. Uh, I mean, the, the squad at the minute was just about getting the fitness levels up. Uh, now we're going into a wee bit of a transition now, working more on football stuff and that. So, I mean, no, it's been good so far. The attitude and the dedication of the boys has been exemplary. Uh, the game against Derry on Tuesday night, what's the overall objective? What are you looking to get out of it? Another 90 minutes of fitness. Uh, really, there's there's some boys who are a wee bit behind, given they came under the, the pre-season with knocks and injuries, and they didn't participate in nearly all the sessions. So, again, it's just building up that fitness level as well. 
in terms of the overall season, where do you see Van Harp finishing, or is it too early to say? Well, it's, at the moment we're just looking to make a, uh, a bit of a progress from last year. Uh, we were third from bottom, and that really isn't good enough. So I mean, this year we're hoping to sort of, at least sort of push on from that and sort of build a squad that's capable of challenging maybe in a year or two. Hi, I'm getting on Grana, um, enjoying the football again. Um, had a tough few seasons, been out injured and stuff, and I've uh, got a good pre-season on my belt so far. And hopefully this season will be good for me. What made you come to Fun Herbs? What made you choose them? Um, well, my time at Derry City, I actually uh, was loaned out the Institute, but I actually really wanted to come to Fun Herbs because I like playing in the League of Ireland, full stop. Like It's uh, it's such a big step up from me, league. And then uh, Pizza actually rang me before Christmas and asked, no one inquired about me, and there was no hesitation. I was definitely come down. How did you find that, Peter? Peter and Felix training? I uh, Peter's training has been top notch. Like he's he's been at there a number of years as well. Like, so he's learned from the best. Like um, so, it's more or less the same kind of training as as uh, as Derry City. Um, Felix is well, it says not right. Like in the gym, it's old school, but it's it's tough going. Like so, there's there's a contrast like between the old school and then Peter's style of training. But either way, like um, I'm enjoying it, and all the boys are. Looking forward to playing against Derry on Tuesday night. Uh, I actually can't wait. I have a few friends up there um, playing against me, so hopefully it all go it all go grand. But the only bad thing about it is um, you know, I'm playing for the enemy, like so. Uh, it's kind of weird, like turning up in the brand and playing for the opposite team. And uh, no, I'm looking forward to it and the banter and stuff. So um, hopefully we just get the right result. I know Derry's been training a lot, and they'll be looking to put things you know right for the start of the season. New manager and players looking to impress. So it'll be the same here too, those new players here, and they're looking to impress, so hopefully, hopefully we get the right result.